Radio's Health, helping you live well with diabetes. An important part of managing your diabetes is monitoring your blood glucose on a regular basis. And EOS Health has provided a glucose monitor for just that purpose. In this video, we'll show you how to set up and use the GM550 glucose meter, and then send in the meter readings. Let's get started. There's many different types of glucose meters. We'll be using the Right Test GM550 blood glucose monitoring system, GM550 for short. It consists of the meter, a package of test strips, a bottle of control solution, the lancing device, disposable lancets, and a cable for connecting to your PC. Only use the supplied test strips with the GM550 meter. Your meter comes complete with batteries good for about 1,000 uses. The very first time you use it, turn the meter over, slide off the back cover, and pull off the plastic tape to activate the batteries. Then replace the battery cover. The meter will do a self-test. Press and hold the main button until the year digit flashes. Press the left or right arrow button to change the year. Then press the main button to confirm it. Next, set the month and day. You can choose either a 12-hour clock or a 24-hour display. Then set the hour and minute. It's important to enter the correct time so we know the time of day for your readings. You can also turn the meter volume on or off. The final setting is for unit of measurement. Select milligrams per deciliter. After pressing the main button to confirm the measurement unit setting, you'll hear a beep and you finish the setup. To make sure your readings are accurate, you should perform the quality control test before using the meter for the first time, when using a new supply of test strips, or if you think your test results aren't correct. Here's how to do the quality control test. Take a test strip from the vial and recap the vial immediately. Insert the strip into the port on the tap of the meter. While the blood drop symbol is flashing, press and hold the main button for over three seconds. You'll see the letters CS blinking on the screen, indicating you're in the control solution mode. Shake the bottle of control solution and apply a drop to the top of the cap. Then touch that drop to the strip. You'll hear a beep and see a countdown on the screen. Compare the test results on the screen to the range printed on the bottle of test strips. There, now you've completed a QC test for the meter.